If you find yourself in a conversation about dieting or weight loss, chances are you'll hear about the ketogenic or keto diet. The keto diet has become one of the most popular methods worldwide among people trying to lose weight and improve their health. Some research suggests that adopting this low-carb, high-fat diet may promote fat loss and improve glycemic control in people with type 2 diabetes. So in this video, we are going to confer about keto meal plans. But before going into the video, make sure that you hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe our channel for upcoming videos. The keto diet, as a rule, is very low in carbs, high in fat, and moderate in protein. Fats should replace the majority of cut carbs and deliver approximately 60 to 80% of your total caloric intake. Protein should account for around 10 to 30% of energy needs, while carbs are usually restricted to 5%. Meat and poultry. Meat and poultry are considered staple foods on the keto diet. Fresh meat and poultry contain no carbs and are rich in B vitamins. It may be best to choose grass-fed meat, if possible, since it has more omega-3 fats and conjugated linoleic acid than meat from grain-fed animals. Green leafy vegetables. Green leafy veggies are extremely low in carbs, making them excellent for keto. They're also rich sources of vitamins, minerals, and antioxidants. In particular, dark leafy greens like spinach, kale, and collard greens are packed with vitamin K and iron. Greens add bulk to your meals without drastically increasing the carb count. Additionally, herbs such as oregano and rosemary add ample flavor with almost no carbs. Here are some keto-friendly leafy greens. Salad greens, lettuce, baby spinach, arugula, escarole, and fryzy. Cooking greens, bok choy, collard greens, mustard greens, kale, spinach, swiss, chard, and cabbage. Herbs, thyme, sage, mint, oregano, dill, parsley, cilantro, basil, rosemary, and lemongrass. Oil and fat. Avocado oil, olive oil, coconut oil, butter, heavy cream. Occasionally, limit your consumption of these oils, which should be easy to do if you're avoiding packaged foods where they're often found. Sunflower oil, safflower oil, corn oil, cut out potatoes, pasta, bread, rice, grains, beans, sugar, and don't eat too many fruits. Start looking for hidden sugars in many of the things we eat, like jellies, pasta sauce, salad dressing, peanut butter, etc. If you would like to eat fruit, try to stick to low glycemic varieties like berries. Eggs. A single large egg contains less than one gram of carbohydrates and less than six grams of protein. This makes them an ideal food for the ketogenic diet. Eggs are also known to make an individual feel full while keeping their blood sugar levels stable. This leads to lower calorie intake for almost 24 hours. Drink plenty of water. Staying hydrated is important at all times, but it is much more so in the case of a ketogenic diet. This is because the body releases more water from the body when the carb intake is a lot lower. Ideally, one should drink more water on days where they are likely to sweat more. Fish and seafood. Fish is rich in B vitamins, potassium, and selenium. It's also protein-rich and carb-free. Salmon. Sardines, mackerel, albacore tuna, and other fatty fish boast high levels of omega-3 fats, which have been found to lower blood sugar levels and increase insulin sensitivity. Frequent fish intake has been linked to a decreased risk of chronic disease as well as improved mental health. Aim to consume at least two three ounce servings of fatty fish weekly. So this is the list below of our keto meal plan. Do surely let us know if this was informative for you. If I like these kind of videos, let us know in the comment section below. That's all for today. See you in our next video. Till then, take care.